today we're gonna shoot a mini documentary and we will test the DJI Ronin SC with the Z50 by Nikon. So and with me is the official videographer who is going to use this. So let's go. It was the first time to use the Z50 and also first time to use the Ronin SC. So it's quite interesting how she could handle this. She's not actually a professional shooter but she does some good things when she's shooting. This is the gateway to the Jean Denzang. This is more than a thousand years old. I mean at least a thousand years old history some of these are renovated after fires during the olden days so this shrine is very popular among Japanese people they come here every new year to ask for blessing it's like thousands and thousands of pilgrims come here you have to walk a line uh, about a two kilometer line before you come to the altar to ask for the blessing but people do it so we came here on a sunday so there's something like a ceremony or uh, maybe i don't know a mass a ritual inside before people actually come here they have to wash their hands and sometimes uh, do a gargle for cleansing. There is a wedding somewhere, and a uh, lady there is dressed in a traditional Japanese wedding gown. And what is she shooting at here? I'm not really sure. I just let her take anything that she sees. She can probably put up the mini documentary that we will be doing about this Shondenzan shrine. So, this is the main shrine area, and a monk is doing some chants. If you can see the wood carvings, they're spectacular. So people come here and pray and we go to the garden. Yeah, it's good. It's stable and well, it's quite heavy. She had experienced some problem though of vibrations. Uh, there are times when you are holding like this, it's vibrating. Like this. And when she was shooting around the pagoda, uh, the vibration started and she showed me how it happened. And it was real. I don't know what's the reason. Oh, look. It's shooting. It's vibrating like this. When I, I do this, it, it will stop. Okay. So she continued to get some more footages around the pagoda and this beautiful red bridge with the momiji. She was looking for good angles. So after that, we left the pagoda and we talked about how it is. It is more comfortable when the gimbal is connected to the camera, right? Yeah. Because you could just push. We the tried red that, button, but it's not right? working. But it's not working. I don't know. And then. Oh, it's 
shaking again. Look. Okay. And stop? Yeah. So what if you're if you're taking something important and it shaked? Yeah. Okay, my main problem here is the control of the camera. If it's connected to the gimbal, I could easily just push the button here. Yeah. But since it's not connected, I have to like let go the gimbal and then push here. It is it's sometimes difficult. Other than that, yeah, the gimbal is shaking somehow. I don't know. Yeah. I hope DJI Ron could fix that, right? And here are some sample footages from the Nikon Z50. for watching like and subscribe so we'll see you again on the next video bye